What's going on you guys, DZ Rocks here back with another how-to. This time I'm going to teach you guys about finger waves. Finger waves. <laughs> no, we're not talking about the black hair style. We're not. <laughs> I promise you. <laughs> uh, if you're new here, subscribe for plenty more content just like this. Drop a knowledge, how-to, comedy, because I'm funny as shit. <laughs> and plenty more videos to help you grow as a dancer and have fun with your boy along the way. With that said, run the intro. Let's get right into it. So, the move that we're going to learn to do uh, looks like this. Tick, 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 tick. Cool. Simple. Super simple. Do, 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 10 digits. Uh, and it's just a cool kind of hand wave that you can play around with. It's something that I just had and knew how to do. And I was just like, ah, let me share it because it's cool. <laughs> to me. I don't care if it's cool. All right, guys. So, finger waves. Um, this is going to be uh, more of digits. Uh, more than finger waves, but they just kind of coincide together. So, <laughs> so um, one of the old school moves that uh, it's funny that I just got off the phone with Sean Fan, Beat Rocker, the 88. He's coming back to YouTube, so I'm happy about that. Shout out to my boy. Uh, I'll put a link in the description if you haven't followed. Go ahead and follow. Um, yeah. So one of the old school things that we did was always the ooh snap. So <laughs> it's just kind of expanding upon that a little bit. Uh, and then just working with the digits in your hand. So I'm the best with this hand, so I'll be working with this one. So uh, what you're going to do is you're trying to break down uh, each individual digit for uh, your hand, okay? So as you can see, it can kind of get difficult to really separate them. Uh, you really do have to try hard to stretch out the tendons uh, so they do. You can stretch it out, don't, don't ruin them. <laughs> but you do actually have to stretch it out so they separate so you can have a little bit more control. So just try it first, push them down, do it slowly so you can go through and try to keep every other finger straight, okay? That's gonna be the first part. Yeah, so what you're really just trying to do, like I said, you're just trying to separate separate the each finger, make sure that nothing is bending when you don't have to, uh, and then you're gonna take it slow. One, try to keep your thumb, basically what the end result is gonna be this. But you're trying to go from this to this to this, okay? That's the whole point. So you're gonna go here, bring your thumb in, pull, see how my finger kind of moves, that's what we're trying to separate, that's why we're taking it slow. One. See? see, it's hard to like, see how that automatically happens. Yeah, that's what you're trying to get better at mentally, keeping it isolated. One, two, three, four, five. So you should be in this like, <laughs> stance here, okay? Then all you're gonna do is continue to fold in, and this is the easy part to just make a fist. Just do it real slow, okay? So once you're here, one, two, three, four, five, and you're gonna bring it in, do, 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 okay? Uh, it's super simple. Uh, the only thing that's hard is just separating each finger, uh, and you can really kind of play with that if the beat is, do, 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 I don't know. You, you can imagine what you can play with it. Da, 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 You can play with it as much as you want to. Um, what I figured out is just trying to have a lot of control over your body to do these things that are difficult, just give you a lot of options. Um, so I don't really focus on this in like a, where can I apply it musically? Uh, just something that I wanted to just get better at, as, uh, having a lot of control. Uh, I wasn't really a tutter or anything like that. Um, so just having control over my hands uh, and what they could do, um, just felt like it gave me a lot more options. So uh, working with the digits again, you want to practice with uh, your other hand as well. I'm terrible with this hand and I don't like it. So I don't really work with this one, but this one, no. Woo! Boy, this one be pink in the tail. <laughs> so, um, like I said, going over that again, it's real simple. Take your thumb in, or you can go from the back. If you can do that, I can't, I can't separate my tendons yet from that area. But boom, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I can go back that way, but not really the other way. And you can always wave it out, wave it in, wave it out, wave it in, and just kind of work with your hands. Uh, to separate uh, from your wrist, from thumb, here, index, ring, middle. You want to make sure that you're being able to uh, really play around with everything because you want dance to be extended all the way to the fingertip, not just to the wrist where people just kind of just let their hands go and do whatever the bat wants. <laughs> so, um, yeah, going over that again, 
uh, breaking down the digits, uh, think about it as just each joint uh, on your finger. If you can do that, hey, I can't do that. So. <laughs> uh, but just breaking down each digit or each joint, one, two, three, four, five, and do, 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 do. Yeah, super simple. Uh, you can start that into hand waves, do, 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 do. And it just kind of gives you a little bit more of a dimension that just kind of looks cool if people can catch it. Um, yeah, so that's super simple. Uh, take that uh, hand digits, waves, whatever you want to call them. Uh, but yeah, take that move. Hopefully it, uh, you can add it to your arsenal, add it to what it is that you play around with. Um, and hopefully it gets you thinking about how small the movement can be to have a big impact. Sometimes it's about the smallest details that make the story uh, amazing and without those small details it wouldn't be an amazing story so with that said thank you guys for watching i appreciate you uh subscribe if you haven't like it if you did if you didn't like it anyway i'd appreciate it leave a comment if you need some more help leave a comment about what you want the next how to be other than that i am dz rocks i'm out